Hi. Decided to share with you what I'm doing to stay calm, distracted, and productive during this time of uncertainty with the coronavirus. Okay, at first I was frozen with fear. I was cleaning all the time, I was watching the news all the time, and just didn't seem to be able to concentrate on anything other than the coronavirus. And my husband's still out working, so that was a concern. I was worried all the time. And then all of a sudden, I realized I just, I had to stop. That was enough. I, I couldn't do that and stay healthy. And it's very, very important that we concentrate on concentrate on staying healthy right now so I found this free course on Udemy by Joelle and Natalie Rivera I've taken a lot of their courses and loved them and this one was specifically on how to deal with stress and uh, the coronavirus you know and be productive and find ways to cope. So I signed up for it and it's been amazing. I'm not finished it yet, not quite, but uh, almost. And it totally was a game changer. I'm much more motivated. I've got some ideas brewing and I'm gonna be working on those. So I'll keep you posted on those as they develop. And I've been coloring. I've been spending a lot more time with my husband. It was funny. We had planned on this year being a more of a time apart. Um, more alone time. Because we've never lived alone. So uh, we thought, well, we'll just give it, you know, give it a try. We'll experiment. And we spent some time together and but a lot of time apart and <laughs> enter the coronavirus and we are now spending a lot more time together uh we're watching the news uh together because i can't watch the news by myself it, it especially the national news the local news is very helpful and informative and and more down to um, not not underplaying it, but it just isn't as dramatic as the the national news is. So I need somebody <laughs> to watch the news with because it's it's just you know dire every day it seems, and uh, which is understandable, but. Um, it's it's something I just don't like to watch alone. And because we need to be informed. But to be overly informed, I'm not going online and uh, looking at everybody's opinions on Facebook or all the posts on Facebook or, or the other news um, channels or any uh, anything else except maybe the um, the bulletins like you know news alerts uh, I'll do that but um, otherwise I just stick to like an hour of news a day and that's really all can all I can handle and then concentrate on work and uh, like I said coloring playing with the cats they're so funny they love this string and they all gather in the middle of a rug waiting for me to play with them with this string and uh, it's it's a good way to de-stress good way to perk up your spirits to play with your pets and um, to find comfort in them and so um, the other things I've been doing been exercising I've actually lost weight it took coronavirus for me to get lose weight I'm not I don't have it 
but I'm eating healthy, I'm sleeping well, I'm exercising, and I'm not eating nearly the snacks that I used to. So I'm dropping weight and it took this to do it, which is pretty uh, extreme. Uh, but I am glad that the weight is coming off and uh, I feel more energetic already. So that's good. Um, let's see, 12 pounds so far. Uh, and so we're watching funny videos and funny television shows, funny movies to, to chill out and also gardening. We're getting outside and digging in the dirt. And that's what my mom's favorite activity was for stress relief. It's digging in that dirt and, uh, it does work. I'm not, I don't have a green thumb, but it does help to just pull weeds and dig in the dirt and, and get close to, close to the earth that way. And, uh, reading a lot. I, uh, have been reading, um, Elton John's Me, and it is so good. It's so funny. He has such a great sense of humor. And there's some heavy duty stuff in there. But he just makes me laugh. I've laughed out loud reading this book. And so if you're an Elton John fan, or even if you're not, and you have a sense of humor, and you like to laugh, uh, read this book. Because there are some laughs in there, uh, in amongst, you know, the darker times. And uh, so that's been, that's been... Uh, really helpful for me too and my husband i've been reading it to him and and uh, now we're gonna get the cd of it uh, because we love it so much we want to hear him tell the story and uh, so now i'm not so desperate i'm not so panicky i'm still staying informed and i'm still a bit nervous of course cautious um and yeah, I'm not obsessively cleaning. I'm not obsessively watching the news. I'm not um, getting lost in the fear, uh, which feels so, so much more um, empowering and calming. So what are you doing to stay, uh, to stay calm and distracted and productive? during this time. Contact me at amy at acnlifecoach.com and let me know. And, and also feel free to contact me at that email address or at acnlifecoach on Instagram and we can talk. We can chat about your worries or what you're doing to stay calm and and maybe even just some lighthearted things that you've you've come across that have helped you i know this is a really heavy duty time so reach out and uh, let me know what's going on no strings attached and uh, no sales pitch We'll just chat. Take care. Hope to hear from you. Hope you're well and hope you're safe. I'll talk to you again next week. Take care.